Moment. Come on now. Artillery shots nearby. Careful now, we've reached their back line. These are Federator cannons. I could recognize their thunder anywhere. Purifiers brought big artillery this far north. It seems that the Senate will spare no expense to get its keep back.
my endurance is waning. to pack yours. Don't be shy. Mojave has everything a soldier needs. Quality on this one is unmatched. You have a good eye. I'll never see it coming. I can't wait to try it out. Your patronage is appreciated.
Almas. they fall.
Don't! You're okay. Decisive victory. On to the next one. Gotta catch my breath. My endurance is waning.
please, look around. I'm sure you'll find something that takes your fancy. You have a good eye. Quality on this one is unmatched.
Last stretch before the walls are ahead of us. If that's a siege, then expect fortifications. Let's just hope the Daybreaker's diversion worked. Only one way to know for sure. LG is requesting reinforcements. They say Daybreakers are attacking from behind, headed toward the main gate. Cell G? Who's in charge of Cell G? Just a guard, Talrog. Talrog's an idiot. No surprise he can't hold his artillery line. Doesn't matter. We can't afford to lose control of Cell G. We have to move. Indeed. Purifiers, change of plans. A group of daybreakers has decided to join the party. More fun for us. We're moving out to Cell G until they're dealt with. Remember your oath. The Senate is watching. Purity in sacrifice. Mojave has everything a soldier needs. The quality on this one is unmatched. Hello there, friend. Please, browse my words. A fine item. Thank you very much.
Let's go! Let's go long die! Keep... Great cover! are all leaving towards South G. What the hell is going on back there? We have to warn the back line. We have to pull back. In 
Incoming! Fire! Three shells left! Where's the supply line? Don't die me just yet. saw this beam's origin below Cordenon. Following it will lead us straight to Crimson Keep. At least there's no way to get lost. Can't carry that. Please look around. I'm sure you'll find something that takes your fancy. The 
quality on this one is unmatched. The quality on this one is unmatched. my friend. How may I help you? Don't forget about me, adventurer, yes.
there, friend. Please, browse my words. You know, Mojave is always the best value. You have a good eye. You know Mojave is always the best value. Another fiend falls. <laughs> Almost at the wall.
Moment. Something's coming our way. It's him. Val, stay on me. We take him together. Frog, kill them. No. What did you say? I will serve you no longer. You will obey his command! Turn around, children. Save yourselves. <laughs> Coming. We've got to help him. Resisting Ahriman's call. We must buy him time. The more they send for him, it means he's winning. They're panicking. <laughs> Endurance is what
them. Father, you have to break free now. Your fury is no more. Father? His whispers have stopped. I am free. Can you fight? I can. You defile our peace. There is no place for you. <laughs> if we can't break your mind, your body will do. <laughs> This is our chance to push forward. A moment. Father. Which side are you on? In the middle of this nightmare, you have awakened me. Your own struggle inspired me to fight back. This is not over. We have to stop Fury's ascent. Araman approaches. I know. And yet we don't have the power to stop the ritual. We didn't come alone. As we speak, a group of Daybreakers escort the Hellion toward the main gate. With it, we'll stop the ritual. The Hellion? It is reassembled. Then there is not a second to waste. Those Daybreakers will get slaughtered if the gate isn't opened when they reach it. Sure. Let's all hold hands together. You made a pact with Araman. How could you let that happen? When my powers unraveled, I was a young Justicar. My beliefs crumbled on themselves as I opened myself to the spiritual world. A life of war hadn't prepared me for the brutality concealed within the knowledge I would soon harness. What knowledge? This world is off course, unbalanced, abandoned. We humans are mere tools left to the numerous fallen primordials, fighting and scheming to return from the abyss, or devising ways to change all of creation to fit their own design. I tried to find us a protector. Surely primordials remain to shield mankind against these absolute threats. If the Daybreakers can conjure the Dawn magic, Anathea herself must still be watching over us. But Daybreakers admitted that summoning her magic was all they could do. Her voice, her insights were non-existent. As I felt the growing threats at the gates of mankind, I scoured the world for years trying to contact her. All in vain, at my most desperate. It was not Anathea, but Ariman who appeared to me. He confirmed what I thought was the undeniable truth. After ravaging the world with their own conflict, Primordials abandoned humanity to war, division, and disease. He came to me to correct that failure. He offered peace to the Four Realms through unity, a way for the Republic to fulfill its vision and gather mankind under a single banner. But it came with a price. I needed to surrender my free will, so he could guide me. The young man that I was, I agreed and embraced this vision as the only possible path to salvation. I was fooled. His grip grew stronger. Then came more war, more loss, more pain. Really? Tell me, father, was it Araman? When you stood aside as Malus arrested me? Was it Araman too when you let her chase me like a dog? I'm not asking you to forgive me. 
I made choices to protect what I could. I chose to lose you so that your ascended brother may survive. If you thought that choice didn't bring me pain, oh, you would be mistaken, daughter. As a free woman, you will have the luxury to fill your heart with hatred because of what I did. But for that to happen, we have to stop our own enslavement. We have to stop Araman. This isn't over. I'll be keeping an eye on you. I'm unstoppable. Who is the Hellion's carrier? Eos Ganez. He leads these daybreakers. Ganez? I guess fate has no shortage of irony. We know. He's the one I talked to when I first sought answers about Anathea. We were both foolish young men at the time. <laughs> 